Joining us at 10, I'm Corey Duke. Stephen is off tonight. An ozone alert day issued for the Tulsa metro area tomorrow. The Oklahoma Department of Environmental Equality is warning citizens of the risks that come with increased ozone levels. Two Works for You reporter Corley Peel joins us live to tell us how you can stay safe and help protect the environment when the ozone levels are high. Corley? Well, Corey, whenever the, a ozone alert is declared, there's an increase in heat and pollution that can trigger health issues for some people. One man told me today he and his family will be limiting their outdoor activities until the ozone levels are safe. Jonathan Kratt says he enjoys taking his children to the park on a nice day, but when an ozone alert is issued, he says his family stays indoors. Just to keep them, you know, from being in you know harm's way and you know from being exposed to anything that might harm them and their health. Air quality experts say the conditions for an ozone alert day triggers chest pains, coughing, and headaches for people with respiratory problems. If your children have um, asthma, you might want to keep them in on an ozone alert day because there there's a, a likelihood that more asthma attacks will be triggered and more uh, respiratory conditions could be a problem. Officials say it's best to put off mowing or using gas powered tools during an ozone alert day. Also leave your car at home. If we can keep the cars off the road that does help. So maybe you can carpool, maybe you can uh, postpone a trip that you would have otherwise been idling a whole lot. Kratz says he hopes more people will make an effort to keep the environment safe. I think if we all do our part it, it's better for everybody. Officials say it's not only important to make these changes on o ozone alert days, but these simple steps can protect the environment all summer long. You can find more ozone tips from the Department of Environmental Quality on our website at kjrh.com. In Tulsa, Curly Peel, Two Works for You. Thanks.